Hello, I'm Mike Fitzgerald with Bobcat Company. Bobcat gives operators more ways to operate their skid steer or compact track loader in their preferred control style. Each control option for Bobcat equipment is a little bit different. Today we're going to look at Bobcat standard hand and foot controls. Standard controls, commonly called hand and foot controls, feature two steering levers that control drive and steering functions. Two foot pedals control the lift arms and tilt functions. For forward travel, push both levers forward. For backward travel, pull both levers backward. For a forward left turn, move the right lever farther forward than the left lever. For a forward right turn, move the left lever farther forward than the right lever. For a smooth left turn, move both levers forward, but push the right lever farther ahead while holding the left lever slightly behind. For a smooth right turn, move both levers forward, but push the left lever farther ahead of the right lever. For a fast left turn, move the left lever backward while pushing the right lever forward. For a fast right turn, move the right lever backward while pushing the left lever forward. Stopping a skid steer or compact track loader is easy. Just return the steering levers to their neutral position. The hydrostatic transmission will bring the machine to a stop. Now let's move to the foot pedals, or the hydraulic controls. The left pedal raises and lowers the lift arms. To raise the lift arms, push the heel of the left pedal. To lower the lift arms, push the toe of the left pedal. The right pedal tilts the attachment backward and forward. Push the heel of the right pedal to tilt the bucket backward. Push the toe of the right pedal to roll the bucket forward. The float feature enables certain attachments to follow the contours of the ground for better productivity and work results. To control the left arm float, you use the left pedal and the right handle. First, push the toe of the left pedal forward. Bring your left arms to the down position. Then press the float button. Release the float button and bring the left pedal to its neutral position. To disengage the float feature, press the float button again or raise the lift arms. Your machine could be equipped with the optional two-speed travel. To operate two-speed, press the top of the switch or the rabbit icon on the left handle. The two-speed and seatbelt icons located on your upper right display will turn on. Press the bottom of the switch or the turtle icon for low range travel. That covers Bobcat's standard controls or hand and foot controls. For more information, see your operation and maintenance manual, talk to your local Bobcat dealer, or visit bobcat.com.